interactions between AC and DC grids. So we have two circuits, DC and AC. DC stands for direct current, in which we have the electrons moving in a single direction. AC stands for alternating current, in which the electrons move in both directions. Historically, there was a fight between AC and DC, but AC won, until recently. DC is now back on stage and it is being used to connect countries and renewables. So we have now both AC and DC working together in what we call hybrid systems. In our work package, we look at different aspects of these two systems as they can interact. So what do we look at? AC and DC systems are connected together via power converters. And then we have protections, which are like police watching the system. Our research package also doing some research on DC protections. When there's a lightning happens, so DC protection is a very important part to isolate DC faults. And we also have AC protection, which protects our AC system. For example, when a tree falls on the line. However, do not forget that we need to look into the reliability and stability of the system. Actually, our topics are very closely related. Sometimes things can go wrong. It is important to make sure that the system always returns to safe and reliable operation. For this, the operator keeps an eye on the system and takes actions to make sure that you have electricity at your home. Together, we collaborate to get the big picture of the interactions and make sure we have a successful transition into a more renewable energy system.